about the history of music and you think about the history of humanity, these instruments that we have, the piano, the violin, the cello, it took centuries of human ingenuity to build these instruments at such a fine level as a Steinway piano. And I have spent my entire life learning to play. So I have a lot of value and a lot of actually data in the way that I interact with my instrument. It's technique that's been literally decades in formation and every performing musician has that. The question is how can you capture that and then what can you do with it? And so using technology like motion capture technology, you can begin to capture all the little data points in time, music being a time-based art, and apply that technique to really any other kind of sound that you could imagine. So take, for instance, the very advanced technique of a violinist moving the bow. Where their wrist is, which string they're on, all that can be captured. That data can then be used to synthesize new sound. So it's these kind of innovations that are absolutely unique to Rensselaer. This is what we mean when we talk about art X. It's all the foundations of what really promotes the arts, broadly described, not just the performing arts or music, but it could also be the literary arts that combine with any of the STEM disciplines, X. And it's that kind of thinking, it's that kind of curiosity, it's that kind of creativity and innovation that's really gonna set our students apart.